Don't worry, Belle, we're not going to forget to bring you to North Carolina. <laughs> you can come out. Why don't you? Yep. We're loading up to leave to North Carolina. We hope to take the Blue Ridge Parkway down. It may take a few days to go, take our time. We've got the bikes in there and Doug has all his work tools because he's going to be painting and his staging. It's two o'clock, Monday, April 4th. We're finally ready to go. We had to do a lot of rearranging in Doug's truck and he had a last minute little plumbing issue we had to deal with at his house. So we're heading out now. We want to do the Blue Ridge Parkway, so we're gonna put in Afton, Virginia, which is where it starts, I think. And we're gonna do no tolls. I think it's about 16 or 17 hours to that point. So it's, we're getting a late start, so we'll, we'll just stop when it's, we get tired, you know, at nighttime. We're not gonna try driving through the night or anything. Well, it's quarter of nine, Monday still. We, well, somewhere in Pennsylvania, New York, I don't even know. We're about to drive 10 more minutes to a, the, I guess so it's the Pennsylvania Welcome Center on I-80. So we figured we'd sleep there for the night and get ready for bed and everything. So Doug's out taking Bella for her last pee. Whoop. There he is. <laughs> She always ends up walking around all the buildings. She wants to go inside. Just gotta hit the road, Bella. Come on. Ready to hit the road? Time for bed. Well, we're all ready for bed. <laughs> Can't see you. <laughs> Bella will come up to her bed. She's down there. Bella, you gotta go to your bed. So we're in the Poconos. Pennsylvania. Oh, we're going to bed. She's buried under there. Good night. Oh, good night, Bella. <laughs> She's not giving up that spot. <laughs> She's supposed to be right there in her bed. Bella's having her morning snuggle time. <laughs> Doug's making his first cup of coffee from the car. We have a collapsible electric tea kettle. Just a pour over coffee filter. This is just a collapsible cup that I got at Walmart for like 88 cents. And I just put some holes in the bottom of it and we use it like as a pour over coffee filter. Just add some paper filters to it and uh, does a trick. We just entered the Shenandoah National Forest. Forest or park? I don't know. On the Skyline Drive in Virginia. 30 bucks to get into it. Doug paid for me because I conveniently couldn't find my wallet at the time we pulled in. Bella is leaving her DNA all over the East Coast. Too bad it's cloudy. The clouds look pretty cool though. Thick layer clouds. We are all washed up and got on fresh granny panties, so we're all set. It is Wednesday now. We are in Virginia at a rest stop. We slept here last night. We slept pretty good. We still have over six hours to get to, uh, we're going near Murphy, North Carolina. That's uh, where Doug's brother's house is. This is what it looks like when we're about ready to drive. 
Just got something over the bed to protect it from Bella. And Bella uses these slow feeder dishes, and I realized that I could actually put water in here and it doesn't spill. Just put a little bit of water, so that way she can have water back here. She doesn't drink much water. I'll just keep filling it up. You getting cold, Bella? She's all wet, cold. All right, let me shut you in. Back up, back up, Bella, back up. She knows. I'm gonna hit the road. Well, Doug and I decided to part ways. He's going to try to get there today, even though it's like five and a half hours left. I need to stop and take Bella out and everything. So we decided he'd go on ahead and get there, and I may take another day or so to get there. So I found this place called Mid County Park, somewhere in Virginia, that uh, Bella and I are just going to go for a walk here. She gets real antsy in the car if she doesn't get her walks. Understandably. Me too. Cool, I guess this place is like a disc golf place. It amazes me that someone's supposed to stand here. Here's the furthest mark. The, the red mark's the furthest one out, I believe. And there's a, bl a blue one up there. It's way up there. I've never been good at throwing frisbee. There's no way I could do that. I don't know if you can tell, but this disc golf course is basically a bunch of switchbacks on this side of this small mountain here. A lot of up and down. Bella got tired pretty quick. This is some steep climbs. Good workout. It's 4.30. I'm going to be there about 7-ish. Probably more like 7.30 because I have probably one more stop to feed Bella and Walker. But this is my first time in Tennessee. It's really pretty. The people are so friendly at the Tennessee Welcome Center. They were very welcoming. Bella was a big hit. Everybody wants to come over and meet Bella. mirrors there so you can see if someone's coming. The people going up have the right of way. So if you're coming down and you see somebody, you've got to try to pull over. But there's a lot of single lane here. But there's little, uh, the wide turns is where you could pull over. The switchbacks. But it feels like your car is going to flip over backwards. Some of these places are so steep. The Prius does fine though. It's all paved got it in B, which I guess is kind of like low. Look how steep this is. It's hard to see on camera, but it's really steep. This is where you feel like you're gonna fall backwards. And there's a mirror I can see. No one's coming. In 600 feet, your destination will be on the right.